So at first I thought, you know, it's nothing. I had actually just been sick, had the flu. So I thought, well, maybe it's my lymph nodes, you know, it'll go away. But then something inside of me said, no, you know, don't go into denial. You need to get this checked out. Um, my mother had had breast cancer twice, but it was still a shock to me. And, you know, I thought, you know, if this ever happens to me, you know, I'll be old and, you know, I won't have to worry about this, but it was still just a big shock to me. So then for the next few weeks, my life was turned upside down. I had biopsies and then finally I, I get the, the devastating news that it was positive. You know, I had to decide, am I going to let this defeat me or am I going to tackle this head on? And at that point I chose, you know what, I have cancer, but I'm not going to let it have me. And that's my, been my whole outlook on my cancer journey. It's Rocktober, and Paddock Chevrolet is rocking for a cure by donating a portion of this month's proceeds to Making Strides Against Breast Cancer. No matter where you do business within the dealership, you're helping someone like Cynthia in the fight against breast cancer. You know what, at the walk I feel so excited, I feel empowered, I also think about those we've lost and it's just a great time of unity and survivorship. As the presenting sponsor of this year's walk, we're doing everything we can to raise awareness in the fight against breast cancer. I hope you will join us and rock for a cure during Rocktober at Paddock Chevrolet. I would tell women you have to be proactive, you can't be afraid, you have to meet your obstacles head on. Please join us on October 14th for Making Strides at Canal Side with the American Cancer Society and Paddock Chevrolet.